Hey everyone, welcome back to the Crypto ZX channel. If you're new, please consider subscribing, but let's have a conversation regarding Jasmine, see what is happening with the price, and of course, what we can be expecting going further into the month of June. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Looking at the overall market, you guys can pretty much see, you know, we're seeing pretty much 50-50, some coins in green. At the same time, you're seeing a handful of coins um, that are in the red, Jasmine being one of the coins up 3.2% on the daily time. Time frame which will definitely take uh, just a quick reminder for everyone I know a lot of people tend to forget this but if you're looking at it on the monthly time frame it is still up 74.1 percent I know a lot of people completely tend to ignore this and you know just a few months back a lot of people especially the holders probably prayed for times like these especially where the price of jasmine is currently sitting at but people get tired very quickly people want more and more and that's just how human psychology works uh, but that's just not how it will go because if things just go up straight forever like that, guess what? Um, everyone would be extremely successful. But let's take it a step further before we get into it. As always, just a quick disclaimer. Anything on this channel is not financial advice. Always do your own due diligence and research when you are investing in cryptocurrency. So looking at the price of almost about 3.5 cents, up 2.6% uh, 2 in all three comparatives, Bitcoin, Ethereum, and USD comparative market cap at $1.67 billion dollars and the 24-hour trading volume at about $100 million. So I did make a full market update just um, yesterday, and if you did end up watching that, you guys know exactly what I'm personally projecting the market to do. And obviously, leading up to the FOMC meeting, after the FOMC meeting concluded, uh, you know, the result, uh, what the decision was, still then, the price of Bitcoin did end up going down. Uh, but let's take it a step further and see how Jasmine is currently holding against Bitcoin's price. Looking at Bitcoin dominance, as I've mentioned in my other videos, if you did end up watching, you know, dominance has gone down a little bit compared to the last 24 hours, but nothing too crazy. We did see Bitcoin retesting $65,000 uh, in, you know, in, in the last 24 hours. But since then, Bitcoin is able to claim back above 66.4. But I still think, obviously, we're still in a weekend. On the weekend, CME futures are closed. Uh, but there's something that's still telling me this gut feeling that, you know, 64.3 um, is still a realistic target once again for BTC to uh, retest. Um, because now, you know, obviously, uh, a lot of people are going to start thinking, boom, you know, Bitcoin is about to make its way back towards the upside. This could give whales one more chance to shake out, you know, the weekend. So that's... That's how I'm currently uh, projecting the price of BTC still uh, not out of the woods in my opinion. I think we could see once again another fake out, but let's see what happens. That's the beauty of doing day-to-day -day analysis. But obviously, um, you know, in the long horizon, mid long, mid, mid to long horizon, I'm projecting obviously upside for BTC. But you know, fa let's face it. After breaking into this 23.6 Fibonacci retracement level, look how many different times you have seen several massive pullbacks and you know a massive wicks back towards the upside. And that's just how the market works, even in the bull market. And what I want you guys to understand is uh, pretty much since February since February of this year you've seen the price of BTC pretty much holding in the 23.6 and if that is not bullish I don't know what is let's continue to take a look at what is happening with Jasmine and how it's actually holding um, you know against this overall momentum that we're seeing so Jasmine you could pretty much say is at 3.5 cents and again it is being supported right now uh, by some significant support that again dates back to 2022 we spoke about this this is not something new and as I've said to you guys in the past you know we need to see jasmine finding a way where it can find massive ground and actually start uh, consolidating at these levels because pushes like these you know a significant rally as well not a small rally by no means you know you need to find a ground for itself and it actually is doing exactly that so you know really really good um, on that side of thing but let's take a look at it on the hourly time frame to really understand what is going on on the shorter time scale not cast but we need jasmine so let's switch to that here we are let's go to the hourly time frames to really kind of get a visual as to what we're seeing so as you know we broke towards a yearly high at 4.5 cents and um, you know pretty much right now i would say it is consolidating really beautifully look at this for yourself um you know we did see this wick just a few hours ago at 3.1 cents and now you guys are probably wondering why this happened let's go back to bitcoin 65k 
So this should give you an indication as to why Jasmine reacted, but that's not what I want you guys to focus on. Focus on this beautiful bounce. So if you had somehow picked up Jasmine around the 3.1 cents, you are instantly up about 11.17%. So pretty much where it left off is back to there. But again, you know, significant amount of resistance coming in its way right now. You can see this for yourself. This resistance is coming in Jasmine's way as it's trying to break towards the upside. If this is able to clear up, we could start retesting 3.7 cents resistance and pretty much uh, make our way back up to that crazy psychological uh, price point at 4 cents. So that's how I'm currently analyzing the price for Jasmine. But especially when I pull out the hourly time frame, I'm very impressed. Exactly what you want to see Jasmine do, it's doing right now in the immediate short term. So kudos to that. But do let me know down below your personal projection. What do you guys personally think? What excites you the most uh, for Jasmine? Of course, your predictions uh, till the end of the year. Love you all. See you tomorrow. I've been Crypto ZX and peace out.